my son came out looking like my 70 year old father. I just started <laughs> crying. <laughs> oh, no. I had so much hair on his head, he had to give him a haircut. Yeah. <laughs> Eight weeks, man. Yeah. To me, I was probably a little strange, like, when my wife said she was pregnant, like, I was telling everybody, I was kind of hoping I had a girl first. Right. Because I knew that would make me a much more serious guy. Does that make sense? Yeah. yeah. Like, I figured if I had a boy, I'd have been like, all right, my boy, yeah, and I could still run around and be the same knucklehead right. I've been for, like, the last few years. Right. You know what I'm saying? So I was telling, a lot of people didn't believe me that. Oh, you're a baseball guy. You're going to want a son. And I'm like, nah, I want a girl. I want to be a little more serious. And then that's what happened after the baby was born. I still was kind of take care of the wife, and she kind of like kind of went to sleep, fell asleep, and then all of a sudden they hand me the baby, and I'm like, so it's just me, like all by myself. And then I, I grew up not around kids at all. Like my entire life, I don't think I saw a baby <laughs> other than on TV. You know what I'm saying? So like, all of a sudden you put a baby in my hand, I'm like. I don't want to break this. I'm responsible for this. Are you kidding me? I'm like, Lord, like, how am I going to handle this? Right. So it like really woke me up and kind of that's instantly changed me. Like, uh, and I just became a, a lot more serious person because right. of my daughter. My oldest is 18 now, graduating high school, and it makes me think because when my wife was pregnant, 9/11 was happening. So I'm thinking, wow, do I want to bring my son to a world like this? And what am I? What are we thinking? What is yeah. this world going to turn in? And then you turn around, and these poor kids who were born during that time are now going through COVID and yeah. the movement and all this stuff that's going on. Their senior years have been taken from them. Right. You know what I mean? It's not been the same. So these poor kids, they're already behind the eight ball, but. Yeah. My wife was in labor for 23 hours. I was dog tired when my first one was born. It didn't hit me for about three days, and it did. It absolutely, that day right there changed my life. Wow. It made me the, day, the guy I am today, and it instantly, instantaneously turned me into my dad. I started checking my insurance papers, making sure they're <laughs> and everything that's in order. You, yeah, that's what you do. You know what I'm start saying? getting your stuff in order. Now I'm going to get us in trouble. Yeah, why is Mother's Day much bigger than Father's Day? Because, like I said, she did 23 hours of labor. All I did was sit around. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I nervously ate in the cafe. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I did when she was. I mean, you gotta right? take care of the moms. It's you gotta take care of the moms. It, it, all about the moms. I, they, they did more work, though. Like, I know my wife, like, when she was in labor, I really didn't want to touch her because I didn't want to touch her too hard. Right. Or, you know, so it was kind of like. When you when you see, I think what drew me so close to my wife, it wasn't the fact that we met, it wasn't the fact that we went on dates, anything like that. It was the fact that me to see her to risk her life, you know, to have a baby for me. And that's and that's a second, that's the closest thing to death. So for her to go through all that pain, I like, guess nothing can like separate from me from my family and my wife. What you got? Hey, uh -oh. listen. Uh oh, leave the face. I'm you just got? saying, like, you know, I could, you know, the baby was born and everything. Reality started kicking in. Don't say what. What you about to say? Oh no! I was, I was thinking about man. What up, man? Why don't we give me some coochie? <laughs> Jesus! Too, too much space in that boy. I'm trying to say, man. When they have, man, listen. When they have babies, too much space in that boy. I'm saying when they have babies. What I'm supposed to do with this? You get back home now. It's like they they be looking like extra sexy. For That's why I didn't go down I'm, there. I'm telling you, man. I stayed way up there. I, I I, boy, I was. I ain't cut the cord. I was feeling on my wife all the time. Like, come on, man. We just. Let's just. Let me see the alien. Something. <laughs> uh, listen. Put it back. I feel bad. Put it back. What am I going to do with this? What am I going to do with this now? I can't compete with that. You know. I can't compete with that. Oh no. no. Yeah. So. No. Like you ready yet? No, boy, I ain't ready. It took a couple weeks ready to get. Oh, wow. Oh my God. That's what I'm trying to deal with. Yeah.